There are few who would deny that what I do, I am the best, for my talents are known far and wide when it comes to surprises in the moonlit night. I excel without ever even trying. With the slightest little effort of my ghost-like charms, I have seen grown men give out a shriek. With the wave of my hand and a well-placed moan, I have swept the very bravest off their feet. Yet year after year, it's the same routine, and I've grown so tired of the sound of screams. And I, Jack, the Pumpkin King, have grown so tired of the same old thing. Oh, somewhere deep inside these bones, an emptiness began to grow. There's something out there, far from my home, a longing that I've never known. I'm a master of fright, and a demon of light, and I'll scare you right out of your pants. To a guy in Kentucky, I'm Mr. Unlucky, and I'm known throughout England and France. And since I am dead, I can take off my head to recite Shakespearean quotations. No animal, no man can scream like I can with the fury of my recitations. <sighs> but who here would ever understand that the Pumpkin King, with a skeleton grin, would tire of his crown if they only understood? He'd give it all up. If he only could. Oh, there's an empty place in my bones that calls out for something unknown. The fame and praise come year after year. Does nothing for these empty tears. That was a dramatic reading by R.C.C. Spider-Con of Jack's Skellington's Jack's Laments from the movie, uh, The Nightmare Before Christmas. I hope you enjoyed. Hit like. Hit subscribe. Let me know what you think. And I'll see you in the next one. Let me know what you want me to read. I love monologues. Yeah. <laughs>